back here for a bit. I was using glowing resin, but it's clear instead of white. Tried to add white color, but didn't work out. Um, glowing resin. So did is the resin itself glowing, or do you have a sort of glowing powder in it? Because what I did with, um, for example, oh Jesus, this <laughs> old old face neck is I had phosphorus powder mixed in with um, resin and then poured it in and got the inlays and those glow in the dark. It's a powder, I have to mix it up, yeah. Mm, white color can be tricky if you want it to be really white. I mean, technically the lumen lay stuff is blue or green depending on what you get. But yeah, I guess it's more a matter of your mix ratios. But it's clear instead of white. Oh, it's clear instead of, okay. Yeah, so the powder, that's kind of what we were running into with the um, five string base that I was working for Johnny because we bought this it was supposed to be purple glow-in-the-dark powder. First of all, it didn't glow-in-the-dark, and adding anything to it just made it transparent. So, unfortunately, it's just a matter of like trial and error, and or well, trying different products. I cannot remember the powder I bought, but like for the um, the first time I did it around, and that worked out really well but I can't for the life of me remember where I got it from. And it's, a, it's about the mixture as well. So you can even put in way more powder than you're supposed to, and you should be able to get the viscosity to about, you know, more so um, white instead of clear. So double ratio powder, I'll try. I, I don't know about double ratio, well, it can be, but just, Add a little bit, you can even just put like a dollop on, you know, a spare piece of wood, see if you can see through it or not, or what it looks like, or um, even just have some waste wood that you can drill holes into and then pour some in there, see if it's the right kind of effect you want. If it's not, add some more powder, up until you get to the point where it is something that you're looking for. But yeah, I mean, generally, the more powder you apply, the more viscous it's gonna be, so the less transparent, essentially.